What works? Brought to you by Aricept. If you follow golf, then you know today marked the start of the U.S. Open. A good time, perhaps, to bring you this next story about what works, about one man who has played in four U.S. Opens during his professional career, but says he gets far more satisfaction these days by helping some of this nation's wounded war veterans get on their own game. Here is NBC's Roger O'Neill. It takes a split second to launch a golf ball. Wow, that's pure. Jim Estes knows the dynamics of the there game. You go. Try to hit it there. But that moment of time is what the pro golfer thinks about whenever he works with wounded veterans. Glue those knees together. Because it took only a split second for them to lose so much. That's all right. The things that we take for granted, they already, they, they appreciate because of the severity of the injuries. Even guys on one leg can do this. You know, so you don't treat a one-legged guy any different than a two-legged guy. Estes played for a year on the Elite Pro Golf Tour. How many lefties do we have? But the satisfaction from helping the vets is why he's given free lessons... And bend forward. ...clubs and balls at the only golf park near Washington's Walter Reed Hospital for three years now. Jim, what is it that impresses you most about the veterans? Well, I think it's their willingness to take on a new task without fear. Estes knows it's not just golf he's giving the soldiers. There's Sean Lewis. He explains to us, you know, life's just, it's not really that complicated. Now turn through. And David Cook. Mentally, it helped me a lot. It's something to look forward to versus just laying in bed. I mean, you don't have to compare yourself to anybody else. It's just you challenging yourself. You know the program has worked so well, the Professional Golfers Association, with 20,000 teaching pros, has just partnered with Disabled Sports USA to expand it nationwide. You guys are insured, right? That will help soldiers like Joey Bozick, a triple amputee back home in California. When Estes put a golf club in his one hand, nice shot. the soldier declared, I'll break 80, which most golfers would love to do before summer's over. Golf has been the quintessential um, focus in my recovery because it really allows me a point to concentrate on and motivate me. Hey, Jim's doing a wonderful thing. Back up a fraction. Esty says what he's giving the vets All right, one more. is nothing to what the veterans gave for their country. See that? Roger O'Neill, NBC News, Washington.